Hey y'all, this is Zach with Meals Under Pressure. All right, I know it's been a minute since we made a video, uh, but tonight I think we got one you're really gonna like. Uh, this was a video that I, or this was a recipe that I converted from a slow cooker recipe to a pressure cooker recipe. It's uh, smothered chicken, all right? Now, I've got two and a half pounds of chicken breast that I've already cooked in my pressure cooker. I've got a video on how to do it. Um, it's real simple, I added a half cup of water, added my breast, Cooked them for 20 minutes under pressure with a with a natural release, and I took them out and shredded it. All right, I've also I've got a video on my channel on how to do that. So this two and a half, which is a little bit more chicken than I normally would cook, but we've got several people eating tonight. So got my shredded chicken. Now you can use uh you can use chicken thighs, which makes this recipe a little bit quicker. Uh, all right, so I've got two cans each of cream of celery soup and cream of chicken soup. Now, if I was only using about a pound or a pound and a half of chicken breast or chicken, uh, I would use just one can, one can each. All right, so I've got some Lipton onion soup mix, one packet of that. Uh, if you got two packets, even better. And then salt and pepper to taste. So I'm gonna go ahead and get everything opened up, ready to go. Now, I left that half cup of water in there that I used to cook the chicken in, so now it's kind of like a chicken broth. So I'm gonna leave that in, and I'm gonna use that with this recipe also. So, all right, give me a minute, we'll be back. All right, so I added my shredded chicken back to that water that was still in there, that half a cup of water that I used. Um, and I went ahead and added my two cans of cream of chicken soup and cream of celery soup. I went ahead and added those because it takes a little bit to scrape everything out of it. So now you can you could use uh, cream of mushroom soup. You can use cream of onion soup. Um, because I'm using the the Lipton onion soup mix is why I use the celery. So, but use whatever you want. But usually a cream of chicken and then whatever with a you know another one. So I'm gonna go ahead and add my let them on your soup mix. Now I'm gonna save my salt and pepper until after it's done, because I'm gonna salt and pepper to taste. I usually like a lot of pepper with this one. Um, take the top, make sure it's sealed. And we're gonna cook, oh, cancel that one. We're gonna cook it for five minutes. Now, when I, when I cook with chicken breast, I always cook it twice. I usually cook it enough to shred it, then I like putting it back in a liquid or something to smother it, and I like cooking it a second time, because chicken breasts are kind of dry. They're the more drier of the meat. Um, so I, I find that cooking them twice really you know, helps with that, uh, the, you know, the, the moisture and then the taste, the uh, flavor and the tenderness. So I always cook my chicken, uh, my shredded chicken breast twice. So five minutes, it's gonna come to pressure. We're gonna do a quick release, and uh, we'll be back. All right, so we kicked it on five minutes and did a quick release. Now we're serving over some white rice. I'm telling you, this is a good recipe. This is a, this is a good recipe. Easy, full of taste. I probably would have added that second packet of um, the Lipton onion soup mix since I had uh, since I doubled the, uh, the cream of soups. Uh, but folks, this is a winner right here. All right, if you like this recipe, like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also our Facebook group page called Meals Under Pressure. And uh, we're gonna get down to eating. And we'll see y'all next time.